in this league today, everybody crashes. You know, we, we have to be all five on the same page, like myself, the, the guards that help our bigs, um, and as much as we can. So Bonus is a strong dude down there, throws people around, and um, so we got to have multiple bodies on it. And when that happens, you're going to have guys leaking in from the corners, and um, you know, just an effort thing. And tonight, they just uh, seem like they won their one. To what extent it might it be just like a battle of styles and the fact that you guys played big, you had a 17-2 to two free throw advantage in the first half, and they were just getting back in transition, handing open looks because you guys played big bully ball a lot. Yeah, um, you know, they they kind of milked a couple plays there, and even in the second half, they kind of brought both our bigs up and um, just set uh, a wall screen for Aaron, and that put a lot of pressure on us as a uh, team with the way we were trying to guard them. That coupled with the way they were running, and they said we got two bigs and we cross match, and um, all that kind of comes into play. Because they were top three in three point attempts and 25th in percentage coming into the night. If they make those shots, they're going to be tougher. Yeah, yeah, and they and they have, and that's where they've been in the past. They make their, you know, their three their offensive you know, juggernaut. They go and do what they do. So, um, and we knew that coming in. You know, we don't look at their record as if like you know, they're 86 or 80, 96, whatever they are. Um, I think if they've taken a step back, they're still that team um, that we, we saw last year and when they played like in the middle. It seemed like Mike going to the line in the second quarter was huge for you guys, scoring and when they missed their transition. What? It seemed like you guys got in the paint last in the second half. What do you think that was? Um, you know, I thought that they played a, a lot of, uh, you know, kind of a two-on-two -two pick and roll game where they let, you know, the two guys kind of handle and they spaced out to the, to the, you know, the shooters and we were a little late on our reads. Get, get off the ball and just at the right time. We still got off the ball, but half a second late or two seconds late. And, and when you do that, you have to reset. You, know, you don't have an advantage anymore. And, um, and that's that's on us as players. We got to recognize that a little bit sooner uh, to make our offense flow a little bit easier. Because we just swung it one time, made them close out, and drove it. We were getting what we wanted, and we just couldn't get to that action enough. But there's sometimes where, like, I guess something like that that kind of does present matchup problems. Like your offense does have to play quite a bit into your defense. Like that, like what helps you guys defensively is just playing good offense. Yeah, I mean, we play good offense and, you know, at some point our defense will come, you know, we'll wake up and we'll, we'll figure it out. And I guess that's what we've been hanging our hat on all year is, is when we need it the most, it steps up. And um, so when our offense has, goes through lulls and, you know, we get frustrated and, you know, balling, going in the hole, we're not getting fouls, whatever it is, um, that can easily translate to the, the other side of the ball, our effort getting back on defense, our communication, like, um, everything seems to stack up and compound a little bit, so um, they kind of play hand in hand. Was there any extra juice out there tonight given the season tournament thing, or was it like a regular season game? Um, honestly, it was the same juice we've had all year. I mean, when we play at home, we don't want to lose at home, we don't want to lose at all, but um, the guys came, you know, with the right mindset. You know, the was joking around playing. Another big game for us. And, um, another challenge. How good was it to see um, Troy get some minutes in there and really impact the game on both ends tonight? Uh, yeah, I was proud of Troy tonight. You know, he did a he did a great job of immediately coming in the game and changing the way that we were playing, just with his effort alone. You know, he didn't have to score a bucket, he didn't have to do anything other than just be on the floor and be himself. And um, you know, him getting offensive rebounds, extra possessions, just led to you know just picked up us, picked up our whole energy as a team. Um, and we need more of that. You know, we need more guys to come and do that, and uh, especially on nights like tonight. What does it take to get your back going against Memphis on Sunday, a place you know a little bit about? Um, man, we got to learn from tonight. Uh, I'm, ex I'm anxious to see the film and us get to get, get together tomorrow. And once we are able to figure that out, we reset. We're ready for Memphis. We know they'll be ready to go at home, and um, you know, they're a team that's historically played fast and, and physical. And, um, and they'll be ready to go, so we just have to reset our minds and we get locked in on there. A couple of transition turnovers and you were just down a couple of possessions. Does it kind of feel like you were just a couple of plays away from finding a foothold there? Yeah, it, you know, it was a couple of plays that I couldn't even explain where it was just like two on one or three on ones and you throw out of bounds and there's like a guy open in the corner and it's just like you know what's about to happen and we just didn't, you know, and we were just right there knocking on the door and like I said, we, we were the ones kind of putting those self-inflicted wounds on ourselves. Um, there was nothing they did in that at that point. It was just a lot of things. We were doing mental errors and 
and things that we just got to be better at. Like we can't we can't do that in transition. We have to be much more solid with the ball, um, and, and especially in big games like this. Awesome. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Mike.